you saw this house, did you ever imagine you'd have a house like this? No. So I was involved with uh, the mentoring program at Rancho Village and that morphed into being involved with the Police Athletic League sports and that's where I met Carlos. He played soccer for me in the fifth grade and was such a good kid, very outgoing and just very likable child. We had gone out for his birthday and he said, Coach Larry, would you help us find a house? They were living with her mother, six of them in one bedroom, in two beds. I really wanted to look for a house like, uh, like last year and this year too because I'm a single mom and I wanted the best for my kids. When I lived in my grandma's house, I stressed a lot about my mom because she goes to work all, the whole night. I pray to God, she's safe. I just wish all my, my family to have a bright future ahead. My son, Carlos, is a good boy. He's my first love. He helps me, he takes care of me. Come to find out there's a four-year waiting list for Section 8 housing. I have a friend that has several rental properties in South Oklahoma City, and he said, just so happens, he's about to finish a house. It was just kind of a meant-to-be thing. They did not have one stick of furniture, not a plate, not a fork, nothing. The Believer Sunday School class just embraced the opportunity. They brought in-kind items. They sent uh, financial gifts, and they really made this happen. Here's my couch just to hang around my huge queen bed. When I got to see it the first day, I didn't want to leave. I didn't, I didn't sleep that day because I was just thinking about the house. I pray a lot. So I think he hears my prayers. Thank you. And God bless you. Wow, I was just super surprised and happy that we actually have a house. People want to do things, people want to give, but they get busy with life. Once you present the opportunity to people, normally they're very generous. This wasn't that difficult. Once the ball got rolling, it became a group effort. It's made such a difference in their lives, and I can just tell how happy they are. Loving your neighbor, most definitely. Thank you for this house. I very appreciate it. God bless y'all.